Uh, hello, this video is for uh, students uh, who want to learn about uh, geology, uh, about earth sciences. So uh, I'll start with a very uh, simple, weed, uh, simple thing showing you uh, how to make a pull apart basin. So you can do yourself. What you need uh, is just like a cutter, something like this, and and papers. If you have Play-Dohs, that will be nice. For example, uh, I don't have a Play-Doh like this. Uh, I have made a model. I'll show you that in a moment. So what you need is just have a ruler. Uh, you can use any ruler. I use, for example, pencil here. So just cut it this way, the paper. I'm cutting it that way. Okay. And so what we do, I'm cutting it. Okay. Uh, now, the moment, think about these, these are the two different blocks uh, of the rock, and if you move it, now see what I'm doing, I'm moving it, the moment I move it, what do you see, you see space here, right, and in fact, uh, so the rocks, when the rocks move and they create space, then you will understand water form in this area, most probably uh, is false, right, so here, along the fault, along the strike of the fault, you don't see anything. There's no space forming nothing, right? Because the fault is, is almost a planar structure at this time, what, what, what I'm drawing. Now, if I do, uh, if, if I cut it differently, um, if I do this thing here now, what I'm doing, I cut it like this and, and step it. So I'm cutting now the fault on that side and in between, like this. So the fault is, again, it's a planner, but now it is stepping. So in this case, it's stepping to the left, because that's the left of me. Um, and it cut it. So now what happens if I move it, what do I do? I'm The moment I move it, I'm for, uh, forming a space here, and that space is a basin. So this is a pull apart basin, because I'm uh, pulling the crust, look here, I'm pulling the crust and you form a basin here. Now the moment I pull a, pull crust, and if you really look carefully, um, what, what do I see here, look here, this portion, the movement is dextral, right, look here. So that, that is this block is coming towards the right of my, towards my right hand, and that's why it's called dextral. So here you're forming a dextral strike slip fault and with that you're forming a basin which is a pull apart basin and if i do now if i reverse the motion i want to move it left laterally look here i want to move left laterally so it's not moving what do you form here you form a that what, what do you call push-up so this will be thrusting mainly push-ups will form here and that will be the if it is if the same fault with the same geometry, uh, if it is a left lateral, then you would expect push ups here, not pull apart, right? So you'll expect pull aparts only if it is a right lateral, okay? So, similarly, the, the what, what, what it means is that the whole of this pull apart basin and the ridge, I mean, if you have a push up or a raising, uh, it all depends on the the strike of the fault so wh where they're going fault trends this one and that one and also for example even if you have the same fault let's say that we have the same fault not lean not planner we can have a fault with uh, it ha it's not planar. it's like this I'm making it a ziggy zaggy structure okay so so the moment I do that, and the moment I move it, how many how many pull aparts do I form now? I form multiple, right? See, I form many. So you have one, two, three. In fact, four. So we have four pull apart basins now forming, and this is how you form pull apart basin. Hope you enjoy this video.